What's happening? How's it going? We're finally back with Cop or Drop. I'm super excited because this is so anticipated for everyone that's watching right now, especially myself. I think now is the time that we bring back the fits. There's new seasons, there's new reasons. When my ops sat, circle the block for you niggas. I got a drop on you niggas. Uh, I circle the police. I'm just gonna give you guys a quick rundown of how the video goes. We're just gonna give you guys three fits. And with these three fits, this is gonna be Copper Drop Yeezy Gap inspired fits at our thrift store. So let's get this going. It's gonna be lit. I'm excited for this. So this first piece is basically the wrong parka. Honestly, guys, like eh, it's not bad for our alternative. And this is like 20 bucks at the thrift store, right? But you know what? I was thinking about making it a drop, but when I put it on, it actually looks like a it looks like a flex. But as you can see, the pockets are very similar to the wrong parka. I'll show you guys the comparison. This might be a little bit longer, and the wrong parka doesn't have a hoodie, but it's still sorry about that. The nylon. It's the nylon parka. Yeah, the nylon. Nylon. And doesn't have a hoodie but then that's very very similar this is just a 20 bucks alternative at a thrift store so i was gonna say drop but now thinking about it i'll say cop cop store this is a cop somehow got me this so for the second fit we have the men's sleeveless shirt and this is actually one of my favorite pieces from the collection i think it's dope but it's more of a summer vibe but it has like that futuristic, like homeless vibes. That's just the era that, you, that's like the vibes that he's on. You guys know what it is, but I really messed with this shirt. I actually messed with this shirt personally. And I can't believe I'm about to say a cop again, but this is a perfect alternative. This is just going for two bucks. <laughs> so that's like mega, mega cheap. As you can see, the details, the details are pretty nice. See that? Basically like very, very similar. It just doesn't have the gap in it. I was actually still wear this. So I say this is a cop. Even matches the easy gap hat. This is, I think, this is the iconic piece of the whole collection. But y'all see the vibes, y'all see the vibes, you see the vibes, you see the vibes. So, this last one was actually very easy to find an alternative to, which is the easy gap. T, that T with the dove in it, this doesn't have the dove, but it is that oversized fit that is so implemented in this collection. As you can see, that boxy fit, the classic fit. Got that drape too, if you look carefully, it has like that drape, you know, you want that drape too. That's like the vibe, you know what I mean? It's not bad, and this is just going for like, let me see. This is going for $2 at Piggly Wiggly. Nah, no, I'm joking, it's going for $2 at Goodwill. This is a really nice alternative, keeps you on a budget, and you're on trend. Honestly, like I say, this is also a cop too. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section down below which pieces you guys would say is definitely a cop. And which piece is a drop but other than that guys this is the last fit but you know what we got a bonus fit for you guys we got a bonus fit but it's, just, it's not bad it's just you know it does the job right it's draping it does the job but i got a bonus fit coming up right so for the bonus fit you guys already know what the vibe is you know what the vibe is this is sick. I really mess with this. I don't know this tee right here. My bad, guys. Not really the biggest hockey fan, but I f the style. <laughs> you want me to mess with the, the jersey? This, this is pretty nice. It's clean. It's just, you know, it's just a vibe. This is good for fall. So this is the bonus fit. Every episode, we're going to have one bonus fit, which will be a foreshadow of what's to come. So I hope you guys continue to watch. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Many more videos coming soon. Stick around because we will be doing an overall store rating to see if this is actually a store that you would want to visit, right? But yeah.
overall, this Goodwill collection is a 6 out of 10. Although they do have a good leather jacket collection, the store layout is obviously a 1. What else do you expect from a thrift store? No this it's just an honest review. Customer service is a 2. <laughs> No one greeted me, but you know, it's not good. It did seem cool, but what can you expect? So we just finished the video guys, honestly. It wasn't bad. Like I'll tell you guys the secret of thrifting. You need to have the eye for it. This isn't like anyone can just go up in there. I spent probably like eh, 20 minutes, but I knew what I was looking for. That's one thing with thrifting. You need to know what you're looking for. So I wouldn't recommend everyone to go thrifting because it takes hours. There's people like uh, Jacob Star, salute to him, shout out to him. He knows he got the eye for, he goes to the bins. And that takes a lot of work, guys. It takes a lot of work. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It just like, it was a, a lighter situation, a softer issue. A couple of tops that are good alternatives at very affordable prices. Because we do know that Gap marked up that Yeezy Gap collection on purpose. We knew they marked it up to the maximum, right? So, hey, maybe you could check your local thrift store if you want. Like, you know, like I said, there's an eye for it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Many more are coming soon. Let me know in the comment section what other stores, any recommendation. It could be a thrift store, any other stores you'd like to see us in next. So stay tuned for more episodes.